Changing Technology. What do this and this have in common? Well, they are both small, and they are very useful. If you think these are just normal old stones, think again. They are ancient tools, the first technology people ever made. These tools helped humans survive. Over the next three million years, people learned how to make many more new and wonderful things. Most of these things made life easier and more comfortable. Can you imagine life without these things, or without tablet computers? But how did we get from this to this? Well, let's go back two thousand years to the very first tablets, the abacus. People used this machine to count and keep track of money, and other things for a very long time. Then, between 1642 and 1644, Blaise Pascal made the pascaline, a calculator or adding machine, that ran with gears and wheels. In 1837, Charles Babbage. Planned a programmable computer, the analytical engine. Here you can see a model of the machine in a museum. It took more than 100 years until the world saw the beginning of the modern computer age and the first programmable electronic computers, like the ENIAC from 1945. These early computers were very big and heavy. You had to wait for days, not seconds, to complete a task. Nobody had a computer at home. The first personal home computers arrived in 1976 with this machine, and they kept on coming. Finally, people could buy and use a computer in their own house. Your parents probably played video games on computers like these. Computers got smaller and faster, and light enough to carry around. In the 1990s, the internet and computer networking made computers really powerful. The rest is history. What new technologies do you think there will be in the future?